Guess I'll do some spidey work while I wait for Sable's call. Hey, what's that? What's with all the yellow stuff? Hmm. Is this some weird street artist thing? A police report. Looks like someone was killed during a mugging, but nothing was stolen. Hmm. What's with the audio recorder? So, you have some work-related stress. Well, you came to the right place. That's my specialty. So they tell me. Give me some more specifics about how you're feeling. Guess you could say I put a lot of pressure on myself. I like to be the best. Plus, I have a very demanding boss. Then what kind of work do you do? Everything here stays confidential, right? Of course. Good. Because if any of this gets out, you're a dead man. The case file says one of nine. There must be more of these out in the city. There's a bunch of GPS coordinates here. I love treasure hunts, but something tells me I'm not gonna find a chest full of gold at any of these places. I think I'm close to another crime scene. Huh. Mystery person's calling card. I haven't left the house. Glad to hear it. What's up? I've been listening to the police radio, and there's stuff happening all over the city, like constantly. Pretty overwhelming, isn't it? How do you do it? I mean, you can't be everywhere at once. Remember what May used to say. You help someone, you help everyone. Yeah, but I never really understood what she meant. Okay. You know that lady that came in to feast the other day with her two kids? The one who just got evicted? Yeah. After she found a job and was about to move into her new place, she told me, as soon as I get my first paycheck, I'm sending as much as I can back to the shelter. So we helped her, and now she wants to help others. Helping is like a force multiplier. Exactly. May was pretty great, wasn't she? The greatest. I'm gonna send you an address as soon as I'm done with all this, so stay ready. Then bring those web shooters with you. Finally! This looks familiar. I think it's the last known location of a Magia informant who disappeared a few months ago. I'm feeling a little uncomfortable. I think we should end the session. Sorry, Doc. I didn't mean to scare you. I've just been paranoid lately. Like I said, stressful job. Okay. <laughs> Tell me a little bit more about your job. Describe a typical day. Hmm. Typical day? I guess it starts with waking up. Check on my phone, see what the boss wants me to hit that day. Then I go grab breakfast. I've been trying to do that keto thing, you know? Then I do the hits. Sometimes it's messy, so I gotta head home and clean up. I try to get to the gym in the afternoon, then dinner, and I... Sorry, um... Can you go back for a moment? What does... do a hit mean exactly? It means I kill who my boss tells me to. I'm pretty good at it by now. Got quite the resume. <laughs> This guy sounds like a Magia Enforcer. Feels like this is just part of the story. I should keep an eye out for more scenes like this. Whoever's setting up these scenes really likes the color yellow. Another crime report. Let's hear what the recorder has to say. So what do you think, Doc? Well, clinically, you're a sociopath. You have no remorse for your actions. You clearly are not stressed. I doubt you think there's actually anything wrong with you. So, why did you really come see me today? <laughs> You're smart. I like that. Okay, let's get right to it then. You do what I tell you, and I won't kill your family. Whoa. You want to get right to it? Okay then. I know why you're really here. I knew who you were the minute you walked in that door. 
And I also know that before I do anything for you, you're gonna do something for me. Well, that took a turn. These crime scenes all feel like covers for Magia hits. And if the guy on the tape is a Magia enforcer, maybe he's the one who killed all these people. I am ready. Meet me at my base. I've been meaning to ask. How exactly do you have a base in the city that I don't know about? Right. Good talk. Why is she always hanging up on me? Maybe she didn't hang up on purpose. She probably just got disconnected. She could be waiting for me to call her back. Or she could be running out of minutes on her cell phone plan. I mean, she's probably doing international roaming. That stuff is expensive. Or maybe she just really needed to polish her pistols. Let's apply Occam's razor. The simplest and most obvious solution is... She hates me. Spider-Man! Taxi! Logic takes the fun out of everything. Hi, Spider-Man. Wow, street performers are getting good. This guy almost looks just like Spider-Man. How cool is this? See the game last night? Talk more about this live streaming egomaniac screw. It's bad enough her show features and glorifies that narcissistic webhead Spider Man, but her <laughs> shows, if you can even call them that, are putting hardworking New Yorkers in harm's way just so she can gain followers, whatever that means. Can't you see her ridiculous stunts are nothing more than a desperate ploy for attention? Come on, folks, you're smarter than that. By watching her shows, you're literally hurting yourselves. So, you ask, what should we do instead, Jonah? Here's an idea. Tune into my show instead. The only thing I'll hurt you with is the truth. Damn, that's a good line. Write that one down, Jared. Let's use it in the next promo. I remember Yuri telling me about a drowning here. She was suspicious because the victim was a competitive swimmer. On the last recording, the therapist turned the tables on the Magia guy. Welcome back. Have a seat. So, did you bring the, um... Uh... Hope this takes care of your cash flow problem. Right. It most certainly does. Thank you. So, I assume you came to me because I have a few police officers as clients. You assume correct. My boss and I are only interested in one of them. And who might that be? Captain Yuri Watanabe. Yuri? How is she mixed up in this? I'm afraid of where this story is going. I have to keep following it. Police ruled this a suicide, but Yuri had her doubts. The victim was part of Hammerhead's crime family. In the last recording, they talked about getting Yuri's mental health records. Here's Captain Watanabe's file. <laughs> this everything? Yes. You ever record her sessions? No, I never record any sessions. That'd be unethical and illegal. Well, we'd like you to record her next session. And my boss has a list of questions he'd like you to ask. That gonna be a problem for you? No, no, no problem. I feel like I shouldn't be listening to these, and yet I can't stop. Seems that whoever left these wasn't satisfied with what the police concluded. There's a report and recorder. Someone fell to their death from this ledge. It was ruled an accident, but was it? All of these reports are from the last year or so. But last month, Yuri assigned herself to all of these cases. Was Yuri the one who left all those recordings? Okay, Yuri, let's move on. Have your obsessive thoughts about this suspect continued? Yes. Sometimes I feel like I've almost got him. And sometimes I feel like I'll never get him. Are you doing your breathing exercises? Trying to. But... I know who he is. I know where he is. And I know what he's done. But I can't do anything. 
not without legally admissible evidence. That must be frustrating. You have no idea. Seems like Yuri's hunch is that the guy on the tape is the guy that killed all these people. I think she might be right. I think I'm close. And there's the trademark yellow. The recorder must be around here somewhere. There's another police report. I think there was a hit and run here recently. The victim was set to testify against one of Hammerhead's men. But of course, police never found a suspect. On the last one, Yuri sounded frustrated. You have no idea. That's it? Yes. I mean, we talked a little bit about her medication, but... When is the next session? Why? What are you going to do? I'm gonna do whatever my boss does, Mendo. Oh no. Are they setting up a hit on Yuri? Gotta get to those other locations. It has to be Yuri who's leaving all this stuff. Another report and recorder. I almost don't want to listen. I remember this. A person got electrocuted accidentally, but the victim had ties to Hammerhead. Yuri tried, but couldn't find evidence of foul play. These case files are getting more and more recent. This one happened just a few weeks ago. You seem nervous. Yeah, well, the chief knew I was working undercover with you. I can't afford to lose my job. Maybe I should be the one doing breathing exercises. Well, isn't that interesting? Don't worry. I won't tell if you don't. Also, you're doing great. You're a very authentic looking doctor. Thanks. I think. You think he knows you were wearing a wire? If he does, he's a hell of a good liar. He's a Magia enforcer. We know he's a good liar. Question is, does he know he's being lied to? We'll find out tomorrow, I guess. You sure about all this? We catch him in the act of trying to murder a police officer. He gets put away for life. Yuri, what are you doing? I have to find her. I think I'm close to the last crime scene location. Yuri's been here. Now where's the file? I remember Yuri saying this was ruled an accidental death. Food poisoning, I think. Hey, Captain. You ready for this? Ready as all ever be. I'm all wired up on my way to the office. Just picking up a coffee first. Okay. Drinks are on me when this is done. <laughs> Looking forward to it, Captain. Yuri's suspended, but she still won't give up. Hard not to respect that. Hi, can I just get a large coffee? Hey there, Don. Who's that you were just talking to? Oh. Hey. <laughs> no. Oh, why did I listen to that? from an unknown number. Hello? Hello, old friend. Yuri? Meet me at the corner of Madison and 23rd. We need to talk. Wait, wait, Yuri! Ah, she's gone. With all that's happened to Yuri, she must be beyond hurting. She doesn't do anything without a reason. So why did she lead me on a grisly crime scene tour? She must have a lead on this enforcer guy. It'll be nice to see her. Maybe help her deal with... Whatever she's dealing with. Wait, what? Yuri, what did you do? That's the Magia Enforcer. Dead. And the case files from all his victims. This guy killed all these people. But does that mean he deserved to die? Yuri! I know what you're gonna say, but just hear me out. The system works most of the time, but there are times when it doesn't, and to me, that's unacceptable. Some people put their trust in fate, or karma, or whatever, but I can only trust me. You can't kill people, Yuri. Apparently I can, and you know what? It felt good. You need to turn yourself in. 
For what? I just dispensed justice. True justice. And I restored a little bit of balance to the world. You're my friend, Yuri. I don't want to come after you. You do what you have to do, and I'll do what I have to do. Goodbye, Spider-Man. Yuri! Tom, what am I gonna do? This all makes sense now. What Yuri did to Hammerhead. She's been struggling with this for a while. She's always held in her emotions. That must take a toll on her. But she's also the most tenacious and stubborn person I know. This was a bad guy for sure, but killing him? That's too much. That's my way in. David, I'm at one of the hideouts. I'm surprised Sable had you working alone on this. I resigned from Sable International in order to ensure the supplies made it to some carrier. Guess she's a true mercenary at heart. Even choosing weapons over aid for her own people. Sable is more than a mercenary. Trust me. Anyway, let me know if you find those supplies. And thank you. That's me. Remember five seconds ago when nobody asked you? Yeah, well, maybe I don't like just standing around, letting the cops take us down one by one. Hey, nobody's taking us down. We got better armor, we got better guns, and except for you, we got better brains. Let them come if they want. They want to die over a pile of humanitarian aid, such as life. Now you mention I hope they do help. What the hell? It's Spider-Man! Get him! Hey, David! Got a question! What is that noise? Are you fighting right now? Oh, yeah. I'll try to keep it down. I was just wondering, how much do you know about Sable's home country, Simkaria? Well, the Simkarian government has been consolidating power for over a decade. They are now effectively a dictatorship. The opposition party, led by the Savinova family, was either exiled or executed. Simkaria has been in civil war ever since. Meanwhile, the civilians are caught with no way to escape and no way to go if they do. So Sable might have lost some of her family in the conflict. Yes, the conflict in Simkaria is more personal to her than she will ever let on. <laughs> done and done. Now, where are those supplies for David? There they are. Hi, David. I recovered some of your supplies. Sending you the location now. Thank you, Spider-Man. I will get there as fast as I can. Great. And if it helps, I have a couple police contacts. I can ask them to help you out if... Oh, no, no, no. That will not be necessary. I have it under control. Thank you again. Huh. Alrighty. There's the entrance. <laughs> David, just found another Hammerhead hideout. Please, be careful. I will. So, what happens when we get all the caches? Some stamps on them and celebrated Eddie's Pizza? <laughs> Eddie's, yes. I will miss that place. He's not going out of business, is he? Please tell me he's not. <laughs> no, no. It's just... It's nothing. And do not worry about shipping. I will take care of it when the time comes. Who's there? It's fire! 
Spider-Man! He couldn't have gone far. He's Spider-Man, right there! Let's go. Everything going okay? Oh, sure. You know, the usual. But I'm glad you called. How did you end up working for Sable International anyway? I guess you could say the job found me. Go on? No, seriously. Hammerhead's guys aren't great conversationalists. Back home, I was a math teacher. I wanted to open my students' eyes to the possibilities beyond our village. Even when the rebel uprising began and people started leaving the village, my students still came to school. And yet, if I had known what was to come, maybe I would have acted differently. It happened in the morning, right as school began. There were nine of them, all with automatic rifles. They asked for notes. I would not give any. The patients wore out. They raised their rifles to shoot me. And that's when she came in. Who? Silver Sable. She took out the whole group. She saved me. And the children. And that is why I owe her my life. Oh. For a heartless mercenary, she's sometimes almost likable. Sometimes. Okay. Those humanitarian supplies should be around here somewhere. Time to find that stash of humanitarian aid. There are the supplies. Okay, David. Found a bunch more supplies here. I'll send you the location. You are doing a great thing. Each supply cache could save hundreds of some carrion lives. Why Simcaria, if you don't mind me asking? I merely wish to help the children of Simcaria, as I once failed to help those who relied on me most. Thank you again for finding those supplies. I will come by to get them soon. Huh. Sounds like David's carrying around a little guilt. Like most of us, I guess. Let's get to work. So where is this base you talked about? Whoa. Your toys are so much cooler than mine. I love this invisible floating fortress thing, but now that all of New York City has seen it, Hammerhead will probably be here soon. I am counting on it, so let us work quickly. I have acquired the Class 5 laser array. We need to calibrate it to prevent it from overheating. Lucky for us, I'm working on my masters in calibration. Let's do this. Okay, what's first? Pull the housing array into place. On it. Yeah. Whoa, nice laser. Housing locked. Done and done. We are not done. Oh. We must reset the targeting field aerials. Sure thing. I have no idea what you're talking about. Exit the hangar and navigate to the top of the nearby transmitters. Alrighty. So, we should talk about the strategy with Hammerhead, don't you think? What is there to talk about? We find him. Then focus the laser on the plate in his head. The laser will heat the carbon steel to critical temperature, which will rearrange its molecular structure. And soften it so I can knock him unconscious. I get that part, but how do you know it won't, uh, melt his brain? When the wolf attacks the sheep, he risks getting shot by the shepherd. Okay, well, Shepard, just remember my no-killing rule, okay?
done. How's it look? Systems appear functional. Now we must test the targeting and power levels. Cool. Wait, this doesn't involve shooting me, does it? Not yet. But I do need you to launch those targets. Right. Okay, ready? Ready. Bombs away! Hit it! Boom! Just a few more. Cool with me, this is fun! Here comes another one! Nice shot! Is this how modern militaries keep shooting? Oh, oh! Can we do one more? Please! You are a child. Yeah, well, we're all children on the inside. Come back. We have one more thing to do. On my way. We must adjust the gyroscopic navigation stabilizer in order to compensate for the weight of the laser. Go to that terminal and wait for me to activate the system. System ready. I'm going in. Okay, that should do it. You two teaming up now? Cute. But it ain't gonna do no good. Uh, Sable? Here's a little help here! The leader is gone. Can you fix it? I am trying. Okay, I'll just do the hammerhead walk for a bit. Okay, time to get personal. Eat this! I just wanna thank you for showing me what I've been doing wrong for years! If I want to rule this city, I gotta modernize! That's it! Evolve! Uh. Now that I'm involved, it's time for me to be the boss I always should have been! Just as soon as I kill you both! You think you're hurting me? Almost ah. there. No. Sable, what's your status? Laser is back online. Uh. Hold him in place. Uh. Now I can get in close. You guys just don't give up, do ya? I respect that, but I'm still gonna kill ya! Come on in, boys! Let's see you die shit! You're going down! Well, this is a fight you ain't gonna win! Man, he's fast! A thing of beauty! Keep trying! Keep trying! I'm indestructible! Take two! Now! Acquiring target! Indestructible, huh? I think not! You think that hurt me? Not even close! Still no respect! What's it gonna take? You know what I respect? A guy who knows when to quit. Commencing bombing run. Damn, I missed. Keep them coming. I'll make sure the next one hits. I dropped the bomb. You throw them at him. Love your tech, Sable. Too bad I gotta use it to take you out. The shield's down. In disguise, bug! Keep your distance! Do not look at me! Look at me! You can't kill me! Way, bug. Yay, teamwork! 
I gotta be quicker! You fight good, but not as good as me! His shield's too strong. I need to disable it first. fun. Hey, you have dinner plans? I know this great pizza place. I must return to Simcaria. Right. You have a war to fight. I do not like to fight. I do what I have to in order to help my people. I know. That's what heroes do. I am no hero. But you have taught me a few things. Oh yeah? Like what? Like how to disarm my enemies with bad jokes? Actually, they're good jokes, but I understand humor can be subjective. Thank you, Spider-Man. For everything. I don't do hugs. Yeah, right. Of course. Uh, hey, can I get a lift back to the city? I I'd swim, but it'd take forever to get the river smell out of my suit. The web shooters are a little tight. Get used to it. Just try to keep up. 